Hey guys, welcome back to Raccoon's Corner, bringing you the latest technology news. I'm going to show you how to run Windows XP virtualization in Windows 7. Now you will need two programs, which the links will be in the description. I think it's XP mode and something else. Microsoft XP mode. So in my start menu, I'm just going to type in XP here, and here's my virtual Windows XP. Now, it does take some time to load, and some time to install. It's just like using VirtualBox. So, this should be starting up pretty soon, but, so yeah, I got a faster graphics card, somewhat, better go back to my desktop. It's almost done. As you can tell see here, it's almost done. Okay, here we go. Now this is it loading up, and as you can tell, I've been using it already, and you do have sounds, and by default it's Internet Explorer. And you, one thing that I don't like about it is that you can't use Windows Movie Maker on it. And what I find kind of strange is when I right click on my local disk and go to properties, I have 125 gigabytes and it's not coming from any of these hard drives. So basically it's just like another computer. And just to prove it to you that this is Windows XP and virtualization, I will go to control panel system and here it is it's an OEM key so don't worry you guys can't use it <laughs> so I don't really mind showing you even though that's not really the right icon right there it's Microsoft Windows XP professional version 2002 service pack 3 and over here is my USB devices uh, shows you what's attached and what's shared in actions I can start it I can send control alt delete to it and it's Windows XP Professional, and so it's a virtual XP. And I can lock the computer, I can go to Task Manager, show my processes. It's only using 5, 6%. It does take a while to install, but basically, this is it. Let me open up Internet Explorer for you guys. Now, this is Internet Explorer 6, so it sucks, but you can just go here, get Fire box.com and as you can see here it says using an explorer so 2006 so yeah basically this is the virtualization now it says it's hibernating the virtual machine anyways you can check me out on my blog raccoonscorner.com where you'll find the links to the two programs that you need and you'll also find them in the video descriptions but check out my blog and you can follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash raccoon tech, T-E-C-H. Raccoon is spelled R-A-C-O-O-N, not the normal way of spelling it, but who cares. Uh, my blog, my email, feel free to email me any questions regarding Windows 7 or any tech-related question in general or a recommendation for video cameras, such and such. Raccoon at raccoonscorner.com is my email address, and we'll see you next time on Raccoon's Corner.